It was Kids Night at Berlin Raceway featuring the Budweiser Super Late Models, Engine Pro Super Stocks, Model Coverall Modifieds, the VROA Modifieds, and the Good Humor Mini Wedges all in action. And the VROA Heat Race number two, Bob Martin goes to victory lane. Model Coverall Modifieds were up next. And lap number 11, Billy Epping, Spink, Zach Clark, Ben Kleiss, and others involved in the backstretch. A couple of those cars would be done, at least for the first race. Josh Fry sneaks past Kevin to good, and it was smooth sailing for Josh. Another win in the number 97 in the model coverall modifies. Engine Pro Super Stocks were up next on lap number 12. Mike Speed and Rob Shoemaker spin. Both cars were able to continue. Then, just one lap later, lap number 13, Dave Hart and Danny Anderson tangle in the front stretch, and both of those cars would also be parked for the remainder of that race. Just a few laps later, up at lap number 19, while battling, Will Olmstead makes contact with Joe Jones in turn number three, and the cars spin. After resumed green flag racing action at lap number 19, Tony Davis, who had struggled throughout the season so far, shoots to the front over Scotty Root, and it was clear sailing from then on. Tony Davis takes the number 88 to the Berlin Raceway victory lane in the Super Stock feature race number one. A full field, a lot of cars tuning up for the super late models. They were in action. Lap number two, a packed field. They go three wide, a melee behind them. Tom Thomas and Chris Anthony both make heavy contact on the backstretch. Terry Van Heitzman, Tim DeVos, and others fly off the backstretch but would be able to continue. Terry Van Heitzman has a result from damage early on. Car smokes and finally tire goes down on lap number 21. Thankfully, Terry off the backstretch into the grass and would be able to recover and finish the next race. Then just one lap later, his teammate, the number 55, Dave Lake, looking for his first feature win ever in the Super Late Models. He was able to do it. He shoots to the front on lap number 21. And for the first time in his career, Super Late Model win for Marnes Dave Lake in the number 55. The Good Humor Mini Wedges were up next on Kids Night, and Sonia Dreesens wins the younger group, and Tony Caputo, last year's track champion, wins in the Mini Wedge feature race number two. The model coverall modifieds returned to the racetrack, and we had an all-green flag race, and the part-time racer this year from Holland, Ben Kleiss, shoots to the front, never looked back, and takes his first feature win of the 2018 season. The Engine Pro Super Stocks were up next, and after heavy damage just a couple weeks back, many hours, a lot of time and resources, Brian Tillema gets the car back together and shoots to the lead at lap number seven. Will Olmstead and Joe Moody tangle in turn number three at lap number nine. Olmstead would be unable to continue. Moody would be able to stay on the racetrack. From then on, it was all Tillema. The freshly rebuilt car shoots to the front and leads the field. Wins by about three seconds. Brian Tillema back in victory lane in the Engine Pro Super Stocks feature race number two. The Super Late Models back at it again for their second of two feature races. After a rough and tumble first race, who would come out the victor this time? At lap number eight, Scott Hansen, Scott Thomas tangle on the front stretch. Both cars would be able to continue. Then just one lap later, a hard impact. Former track champion, the number 21, Terry Van Heitzma. The bad luck continues. Terry hard into the turn one wall. Terry would be done for the rest of the night. After slowly but steadily working his way through the field and after some damage in the earlier race, Terry Seneker in the fair car shoots past Michael Simcoe at lap number 19, and that's all he needed to make it two weeks in a row, taking home a feature win in the Budweiser Super Late Models for Terry Seneker. And to wrap up the evening, it was the Mike Becker Memorial 30-lap feature race. Dan Diamond backs it in the turn three tires. Thankfully, Dan would be okay. At lap number eight, another melee, Jason Burris, Tom Borsma, and John Evans all tangle in turns one and two. Hard wreck for Borsma. Burris and John Evans would all be done for the rest of the evening. Then at lap number 18, Bob Martin spins and Ryan Borsma also spins. Backs it in the turn three wall, a heavy driver's side impact. Thankfully, Borsma was able to get up and walk out of the car. From then on, we had 12 laps to go, and Todd Cowan in the green car was able to hold on, make his way through, and he makes his way. It takes home the Mike Becker Memorial VROA Modified Feature. Up next week, it's 80s Night at Berlin Raceway featuring live music before the races. Make sure to wear your best 80s attire for a chance to win Berlin Raceway tickets and a gift card. The Sprint Car is in action along with the Super Stocks, Sportsman, and Four Cylinders. And just two days later, it's the Money of the Bank presented by Premier Plastics. Pre-race autograph session with Kyle Busch, some of the biggest racing superstars along with all your local favorites in action. The CRA Super Series and the Musty Racing Sprints also added to that card to make big two nights of racing, June 9th 
and June 11th. All the details, tickets, and more all online, BerlinRaceway.com.